and welcome. Today we're going to take a look at the DIY full battery tester. We're going to test out some of these batteries. Got a night vault, double uh, A rechargeable, regular double A, triple A. I'm going to try to see if we can read this lithium ion battery. Better for a while, I'm not sure how it's working. And then we're going to try to test out this CR2032 battery. All right, so let's get started. Very simple, actually. So to test out the batteries, we have a red for positive, black for negative, and then you're just gonna set your dial to where you need to. So we're gonna start out with this nine volt battery here. That way you gotta just find the settings for nine volt. Okay, so looks like it's gonna be this way. Okay, nine volt. Okay, and there's your meter right there. So it's at zero right now. So let's uh, let's test out the nine volt battery and see where it's at. We're gonna take the red, line it up to the positive. Okay. Okay. Then we're gonna take the black, which is the negative, and we're just gonna hold it. Okay. I'll hold it in the readout for this is that it's solid you know well, we have a full battery at eight eight nine eight point eight nine and it's almost at ninety five percent as you can see now if we take this off see it goes back down to zero now right, so let's try the rechargeable battery now I charge this so I know that it's full we're going to take a look at a one point five volt battery so now we're going to move on to this rechargeable AA battery. We're going to take the dial so that it's pointing to the AA right there. And do the same thing. Red is for positive, black is negative. So we're just going to put that together. We're going to get our reading here. Okay, so here we go. It's 70%, uh, 1.26. So it's almost almost charged as a rechargeable battery so we're, we're pretty close um, but we can connect this to a charger and we can get it to full power so let's look at a regular battery oh so I was gonna I was gonna throw this one away but it looks like it's uh, at 80 percent Okay, it's at 80%, 1.25, so you can see where the little needle is at. All right, let's just switch over and see if we can get a readout for a AAA battery, a rechargeable one. So you're gonna go down to 1.5 and let's see a little AAA battery, and get a readout on that. By the way, this is a rechargeable one and it looks like it's at 60%. So 60%, we can connect that and get it to full charge. All right, let, let's try one of these little button batteries and then we're gonna move on to the to the bigger battery. So if you wanna check the little button battery here, uh, this is a three volt, three volt battery. So let's uh, bring it down to Three volts and that's the uh, same thing just find the positive there I know this is brand new so it should be just fine so we're just gonna peel this back okay and then we're just gonna hold that part together so you can see the readout it comes in so yeah 100% see it right there 100% 3.5 right there full charge so all you do is you just hold it like that together and that's how you're getting the readouts. There's a 100% full charge on a button battery. Now let's try the lithium uh, by ion battery by JBC. I'm not sure how well that's going to work, but we're going to gonna give it a shot and see what it's like, see if it reads it out. So it's a 7-volt battery, so closest I can get it is bring it up to, uh, let's, let's do the 9-volt right there. Let's leave it at 9-volt and then try it out so on the JBC there's a symbols down here positive and, and negative so let's just hold it there hold it there 
and I am not getting a readout at all. So either it needs to be put on another setting or yeah, because it's getting, it's like it's zero. It's literally at zero. So let's try let's bring it down. It might not be working because there's a seven volt battery. So the negative and positive and it's completely zero so this might not work with these batteries or it could be that this one's completely dead so there you go uh, this is five types of batteries without the exception of this one so that's it